Giovanni Segantini, Still Life, 1884. The painter Segantini went through various stylistic phases in his artistic career and chose very different subjects. His most famous works are linked to the planar painting and to the images of pastures and mountains to which he was particularly tied. But having studied in Brera, here he shows us that he knows perfectly the genre of still life, a subject that from Caravaggio onwards has never really gone out of fashion. In this painting, which represents a table covered with a crumpled white canvas and above some common vegetables, Segantini doesn't use yet the divisionist technique which will later characterize its production, but chooses to use, to use rapid touches of color. They are poor, simple, common vegetables, some carrots, a cauliflower, and some celery stalks, as if someone made a farmer was about to prepare a tasty soup. Gaetano Priviati, Quiet 1091, Privati from the Scapigliatura Milanese comes to the Divine, definitely passing through the imprisonment, and the dishane and plain air is precisely the point of contact between the three walls, basically not so far apart. If for the imprisonment, the light falls fundament, so it is from privati. The shame that he represents here is a serum country mage. The dressing points of white, the clothes of the protagonist, are distributed evenly in the lawn, which occupies almost the exact half of the work. The lawn is more clearly riddled with the filaments of light and color that characterize the division technique chosen by the artist. The subject is said either by that person is an obvious reference perfect. It is a tribute to the works of Monet, who has repeatedly painted women, on the lawn with a parasol to shelter from the sun.